Good afternoon everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a one hour power hour clean with me. My daughter just lay down for nap. She typically only takes right around an hour, maybe an hour and a half if I'm lucky. So I'm gonna see just how much I can get done in that time frame. Alexa, start a one hour timer for cleaning. Cleaning timer, one hour, starting now. We're gonna get started in the kids slash guest bathroom which they leave toys everywhere. They have the toilet paper stick missing. I don't know where that is. I'm hopefully gonna find it while I clean this. No bag in the trash can. Who knows what they've done to my cleaning stick. Shower's a mess, and I just clean this. Floor, clothes over it as usual. As you can tell, I'm running out of my antibacterial wipes and they're nowhere to be found. That's really, really sad, but I will hopefully find some more this week. I love my little sign, if you can see it there. It says you never know what you have until it's gone and it's a toilet paper roll. I really like that, especially with what's going on right now. There's more antibacterial wipes. I knew I had another one. And these wands that I'm using for the toilet bowl, I absolutely love them. They are still my favorite thing. And they are antibacterial as well, as long as you don't flush right away. Make sure you read the package. I think it's like 10 minutes, but again, read the package. Aside from mopping, this is one room down, clean, and the mirror is already done because the kids did that on chores the other day, and that's already been scrubbed too, so one room down. Now I'm going to go ahead and throw a load of laundry in and get that started. This is just the kids' clothes, which I feel like I'm always washing kids' clothes. My couch is forever messed up. These kids use the pillows to make forts and to pillow fight, and of course, we found my husband's bottle of beer from the night before stuck behind one of the cushions, and the kids bring toys over while I'm trying to clean, and more clothes behind the couch. It's just always a mess over here, but it's like a little treasure hunt at the same time. You really never know what you're gonna find in that thing. dishwasher and I'm definitely not gonna let this one run for too long because it was like a game of Tetris the kids decided to use almost every single cup in the cabinet today and there was no way that was all gonna fit on the top rack so that is one of my daily struggles for some reason they all have to use two to three cups in the house no matter what I do every single day it's almost every cup in the cabinet has gone wash what didn't fit in the dishwasher and continue on with the clean before time runs out. Now 
One thing that always makes me feel better is cleaning the little fingerprints off of the stainless steel in our kitchen. I don't know what it is, but there's something so satisfying when all the appliances are nice and shiny. With making this a power hour clean, I didn't have time to pull out my usual glass top cleaner, so just a normal glass cleaner is gonna have to work today, but it did the job for now. About 11 and a half minutes left and got a little decent amount done. Giving the kitchen one final wipe down, getting all the little stickies off. There was Play-Doh and slime and all kinds of stuff from Declan and Brianna playing this morning. And there is one little tough area that of course I had to spray let sit for a few minutes and then really put a little muscle into. Not sure what that was, and honestly not sure if I really do wanna know. Now I'm just gonna sweep this section up here in front of the house. There's a lot of dog hair and dirt for some reason that's been brought in really bad this last couple days. Normally I would vacuum this, but with the baby sleeping, her room is pretty close to that spot and I didn't want to risk waking her. Lastly, I'm gonna try and fold this basket of towels. I don't know how many I'm gonna get done before the timer goes off, hopefully the whole thing, but honestly at this point I doubt that because I've only got like three minutes to go. Your cleaning timer is done. <laughs> so as you saw from the timer, one hour is completely done. The kitchen, all the dishes are done. They need to be dried, of course, but that's okay. But all the counters are wiped, all the appliances are wiped down. Dishwasher started, so that's done. We do have a load of clothes in the washer. I pulled about half that basket over there. The couch is all done. The guest bathroom is done. And this entire front walkway and entryway has been taken care of and that guest bathroom has been done. So I think that's a lot to get done in an hour. I'm actually pretty proud of it. And the baby's still napping, so I can finish the rest of that basket. So since Gwenny's still napping, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna finish folding these towels. That's the one thing we didn't get done. I am gonna mop the tile, but I'm probably gonna wait till the kids go to bed for that. But I did wanna say thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you want more videos like this. And I'll see you guys next time. Good night.